Hey guys, how are you? Um, I am just outside enjoying the sunshine. We finally got some sunshine here in Denver. I don't know if any of you guys were able to see the Aurora Borealis. Um, that would have been really cool. I tried to see it, but just didn't get the, didn't get the light show down here. Uh, which I was surprised. I think there are some places even as south as Florida that were able to get some really cool uh, photos of the uh, Aurora Borealis. Uh, these geostorms that are hitting our planet right now are a very next level. This is probably one of the most intense geostorms we've seen since 2005 from what I understand. And um, one of the things that I've noticed over the last two nights, and I don't know if any of you guys have noticed this, I asked in my alchemy group, and um, I, think, I think one or two of you have felt this, but I have woken up in the middle of the night so parched, like so thirsty. <laughs> I said, it's like I went to the sodium buffet and like just gorged on sodium food that like was just I don't know it's like I feel like the Sahara Desert is in my mouth and it doesn't matter how much water I drink my body is just dying for more water which of course whenever we have these um, electromagnetic kind of uh, storms coming in you know we're definitely electric beings <laughs> we have an electric charge and a magnetic charge and so because our bodies are 70 percent water you know these storms affect water greatly i think even just um last week they lost radio signal over the indian ocean um and so there's a lot going on and I don't, i'm just curious if you guys let me know in the comments how you guys have been experiencing this. If you've had any, I don't know, intense downloads, dreams. Um, I am going to be hosting a solo podcast this week. I wasn't going to. I was going to put in a different guest, but I'm being really called to share some information with you guys that over the course of two night I was down I was woken up from my dreams because I was being downloaded with so much information that was originally I was originally told it would start coming through my dreams six months ago um, and it's about some sort of time ancient time travel device <laughs> so uh, that's all I'm gonna say there um, but Things are really, really intense right now. And you know, there's all the kids are just enjoying themselves at the park. So let's just let their energy infuse this video, <laughs> all their laughter. Um, yeah, so <sighs> these storms, what I've noticed for me and um, this may be similar for some of you and you may not feel it right away you might feel it as the weekend unfolds and into like Monday Tuesday but I have noticed that I am getting so much clarity coming in about things that I've been percolating on wondering and stuff I wasn't even sure if I wanted an answer to like I was just kind of playing around with some ideas and things like that and um, but I'm just getting so much clarity about my work, um, my creativity, uh, just anything. Like it just feels like everything's coming in my personal life. And so when we think about the sun, the sun represents, even in the tarot deck, right? Um, it represents consciousness. It represents clarity to the highest degree. The moon represents confusion. It represents the darkness, the shadows, the things we don't see, the things that are hiding in the background. So when the sun has these massive ejections, um, these coronal mass ejections that come off of it and then create these geostorms here on the planet, especially when we have like, I think it was like five storms, three of them hitting us directly uh, this weekend, it can bring in a lot of clarity for us. So what I would say to you guys is if you have 
questions about things in your meditation before you go to sleep tonight, set an intention to bring in clarity around that area because I feel very strongly that that could be enhanced greatly during this uh, weekend uh, alone just because of all the energies that are coming into the planet. Um, the Aurora Borealis, sorry, I'm just getting a download right now, so I'm going to share it with you um, because I'm being shown visions of, and I'm hoping this is coming through okay, and that the loudness of these kids is, they're just so happy. So <laughs> let's just celebrate happiness right now. Um, though, you know, we talk about dark matter, right? And then the light show and... Um, and there was a TV show that I watched. I think it was, was it called Dark Matter? I think it was called Dark Matter. And it was really cool. And just the, when we have these, like this show of the Aurora Borealis being able to be seen as South as Florida for some people. Um, and I think it was more so on the East Coast than the West Coast. I could be wrong. So you guys correct me if I am. But there's um, the dancing of the, electric charge in the air with all of the field that is unseen it starts to it, I want to say it upgrades your energy in a way that allows you to access certain information certain ideas it expands the possibilities of how you're interacting with your reality right now to unfold in ways that you wouldn't normally expect and that could be both positive and negative, I wanna say. Um, it really depends on the level of consciousness of where you're at right now. Uh, so be mindful of that. But there's something about how the matter is, that we don't see, right? The matter, that the dark matter, uh, how that starts, I wanna say, cause I'm trying to understand this download as, as it's coming in. The particles are dancing with your particles in elevated ways that start to make shifts and changes in your reality if you've got the right intention. And when I say the right intention, meaning it's directed, okay? So it's not that it's about right or wrong, but the, the, a directed intention on what it is you want to interact with right now. So there's a play of possibilities in the air right now while also infusing you with so much clarity higher levels of consciousness to bring you forward in ways that okay so they're showing me like leap jump like leapfrog jumps so you can make leapfrog jumps right now um and i'm not saying like this would be in just it could even be in the most minor way in your life. You know, it doesn't have to be this grand scale thing, but whatever it is, you can make these leapfrog quantum like jumps um, because doors are opening that wouldn't normally be open in such a um, elevated state of light particle interaction. Um, so yeah, okay, there's that. So um, get clarity this weekend ask for it bring it in and and who knows who knows what's going to come in let me know in the comments what you guys are feeling and what you guys have experienced i'd love to know um stay tuned i have for those of you in alchemy kind of know you know one of the new ideas that i have been kind of pitching around seeing if i'm going to do it or not uh, and i am i am I, i've been kind of sitting on this for a little while and I've been kind of like should I shouldn't I should I shouldn't I and I am gonna bring a new flavor to my podcast it's going to be in addition to my weekly show so you're not gonna miss those anymore and um, it's gonna be fun it's gonna be really fun and then there's gonna be another edition I'm bringing two new additions to the podcast every week um, where you guys are gonna get engaged so much more and you're gonna have an opportunity to be part of the show as well but we're gonna like we're gonna have some fun with this 3d reality bring in some more humor bring in some different insights and I'm gonna kind of teach you guys some stuff um, from a completely different perspective that most people wouldn't expect from me so that being said I love you guys um, tickets for the new retreat are on sale and I will talk about that on the next podcast because I'm bringing in some new elements to that 
So I'm shaking it up for the uh, next retreat. Um, I'm going to be bringing in someone different. Uh, Christina is just so amazing, but there's some thir certain things that with her schedule and things that have been going on with me that she's not going to be able to come in this time. Um, so I've got someone else uh, that's going to be joining me. Ooh, who could it be? Uh, you will find out soon. You'll find out on Tuesday. And uh, we're going to be, I'm going to be adding in a whole new element of uh, intuitive upgrading for you guys. Psychic upgrading, intuitive upgrading, higher self uh, interaction. Uh, so a lot of the elements of the next retreat will be brand spanking new. Uh, tickets have already sold. If you're interested in coming, uh, I'm going to leave the link for a uh, link below this. It is September 18th through the 21st uh, during the Pisces full moon lunar eclipse, which is Pisces is the house that my entire forbidden journey program is designed upon. So like this one's going to be potent. And like I said, in my uh, all signs, it is going to be the last one I do for a little while just because there's some things going on in my life that are not allowing me to set in stone when the next one will be. So it might even be up to another year before I do one. So if you were thinking of wanting to get in, this is definitely a time to uh, book in. If you have questions, send me an email, Nicole at NicoleFrolic.com. And of course, if you guys need your own community, okay, if you're feeling lost, if you're feeling like you need some like-minded souls, join the Alchemy program, okay? The Discord chat is there for you guys to make new friends, for you guys to ask questions, to interact with one another, and the people in there are like truly family. Everyone is so generous with their time, their insights, their love. So if you're feeling a little alone or you need some, um, you just need some extra, I don't know, soul love, soul fam love, uh, alchemy is a great place to start. All right, guys, I love you. Have an incredible weekend, and I hope you get the clarity that you need. And I just want to say happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. Uh, you're doing a great job in this world. All the kids need you. I love you guys, and I'll talk to you soon.